Oh geez, oh geez, oh, oh geez. And they're dropping, they're dropping people. We got manga and we got lots of it. I am always opening manga. I am always getting manga in the mail boxes and boxes and boxes of it. So I had a bunch come in and I just thought my people here might just want to watch an unboxing once in a while instead of just seeing it all at the end of the month in a haul. So let's crack this open. I'll tell you some stories. I'll show you some cool stuff I got. Let's go. Okay, I have four boxes here. Some are heavier than others. Some are used manga. Some are deals I've found. Some may be the usual suspects, but I haven't, I haven't done a box opening in a while. So I thought these all came at once. Let's crack them together. Let's see what's in them. Some of them I actually can't even remember what is inside them. So we'll crack these one by one and I will give you the area view of what we got all right box number one not super heavy we got a knife here and let's crack a lack this open let me know down below do you guys get excited for mail and i'm not talking bill i ain't excited for bills i'm talking manga surprises gifts anything like that you would get in the mail do you get hyped for it because i do because i do all right let's see what's in this one okay we got this first box here i thought i'd just show you guys this stuff up and close because it's just easier that way Let's crack this open. All right, pretty sweet. This is Banya, the explosive delivery man. If I'm saying that right, Banya? Now I got volume one through five. This is obviously used. Now these are dark horse. So these are a little older and they are harder to find. Some obviously are easier than others, but I can't remember. A couple of these are worth some decent money, definitely above retail. And I was pretty happy to find these online. Someone was selling them for or pretty dang cheap so I was able to get the set and I'm pretty happy these spines look pretty sweet too and if you didn't know the art in this is pretty sweet a lot of dark dark ink back in the day when they just splashed the black ink on the page and everybody had a good time and it looks fun and action-packed I'm happy to have these all right all right that was a D start we got another box here this one is significantly heavier than the last one this one has got a lot more stuff in it i think i remember this one so this one's pretty cool let's take a peek at what's inside this one okay next box here next box not to be confused with x box this one has uh more manga in it than the last one this is all used manga also okay so this is four different sets of manga a couple random ones got rave master one through four kind of blends into the background there these are all used manga library copies stuff like that none of them have rips or tears or anything in them but you know they're old i got all Ultra Maniac 1 through 5. I have heard of the series. I don't know if it's good. Some of these I got for my wife and some I just got because they were so stinking cheap. They were all together. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if she'll like this series or if she even wants to read it, but it was so cheap. And then I got QQ Sweeper 1, 2, and 3. Now she already owns QQ Sweeper, but I know, and these are library copies, so they are not in the best condition, but I know some people are looking for them. So I just grabbed them and then I got this series too, Kiss and White Lily for my dearest girl two through nine and I don't know anything about this series also these are library copies as you see but the spines look pretty decent on them and there's no damage whatsoever here I got this whole chunk of manga for like $30 but let let me know if you would be someone who would buy a chunk of manga for really cheap and a great deal if it had some light damage and or stickers so for the last one do you guys care about when it comes to stickers and stuff on your manga if it's not the most super important manga to you do you care how much goo and gunk is on the outside or do you only like it if you can take it off or remove it and or, or something like that all right this one is pretty cool so let's check out this next box here this one is a pretty cool one okay the next one here is something a little special so let's grab Grab this. this is a special edition so this is dementia 21 now I got the other one of this what I mean by that is there's another one out there 
that's a little older apparently, which I didn't know. And it is the same books, but there is a different front cover and a different back cover. And I think there might be other small differences in the artwork or something. These are a special edition box set that was reprinted. So you'll most likely get this version that you see. This is a pretty cool story and I'm happy to have it in the collection, even if it was two times. All right, last but not least, the biggest and the baddest. This one is a lot of good stuff. This box, however, looks like it went through a couple rounds. It is misshapen and that usually means it got tossed around or something like that, got beaten, banged up. Let's hope the heaviest box that obviously got the most damage in the mail doesn't have the manga all beat up. Okay, we got the big chungus, can't even fit on the screen, but this is the one that has some damage on it here and here. It looks like it got banged around, so there's a lot in here, at least I see. Let us let me grab these one by one. Okay, they are packed in there pretty good. We got Strongest Sage with the Weakest Crest, Otaku Elf 6, Unwanted Undead Adventurer 9, Multi Mind Mayhem 8, Rising of the Shield Hero 21, Daemons of the Shadow Realm 2, Kimono Jihan, Jihan 7, Reborn as a Goblin 3, One Punch Man 26, Noragami 26, two 26s, I'm Quitting Heroing 3, a new one, The Witch's Marriage 1, One Dance 6, Soloist in a Cage 2, Valiant Must Fall 2, Number 6, 3, Number 6, Volume 2, in here. And I think I did order that, so it might be on Backstock or something. Alice in Borderlands 7, Insomniacs After School 3, and Shonen Note 5. That's a solid stack in that box. If you like free manga, make sure you watch my videos. Make sure you're liking, you're commenting, you're subscribing, and make sure you're checking out my Instagram. I'm going to be doing a Instagram giveaway for $20 of sci-fi -er. Link in the description. Credit for the website. Thanks for watching. See you next time.